Hello folks, this is a beautiful day here, Thursday. I'm at the Little Rock, Arkansas. Uh, this is, uh, as you see, brand name, Volvo Trucks. Uh, this is uh, another name, the company name of Tri-State Truck Center. And this is uh, Mac Truck. Uh, they do specialize in uh, uh, Volvo, Mac Truck. Uh, nationwide, that's uh, their biggest company here. And uh, today I had a truck problem, not a truck problem. A uh, brand new injector has a uh, program required. So I'm visiting here, uh, Little Rock, Arkansas, uh, reprogram for the my brand new injector. Uh, one in the injector replaced a few days ago, need to uh, program. Uh, they say it takes about one or two hours to program and uh, cost about uh, every place a little bit of a different price but they say $500 uh, this is beautiful Thursday uh, local time right now uh, 4.41 p.m. Uh, this is a service department here. Then also they got very nice uh, drivers lounge. You can watch TV, get some take a nap. Uh, they got some also here. Uh, people need a laundry. Uh, that's what I need to buy, laundry. They got dryer, washer. There is room. And also men's room. And also this uh, Max got it. Uh, this very uh, old picture. You hurry before you will be hearing it more. Uh, this Mac truck. What year is it? Uh, they say, let me see, what year? Must be 1950 uh, and 60. This are all trucks like that they didn't put the year uh, gotta be 1960 okay uh, this is a lounge and TV microwave this is service department Oh, look at that. Hi. Howdy. Hello to my YouTube channel. Howdy. <laughs> I, I get my YouTube channel advertised them for you. I get about 200 and, uh, reviews. And also they get a nice uh, service menu here. Yeah, he came out. Uh, first service oil change is 379 Break after for 75 and an ace sub is 355. Yeah, uh, that's need to replace yeah. my battery 131. Uh, Windsill replaced 280. That's a nice price. That's 19. Uh, this picture gotta be 1930, right? 1930, 1920? Uh, maybe the 40s. 1940. Wow. It's 30s or 40s, I would think. Yeah, 1930, 1940. That's Uh, this is uh, all Mac truck here too. International Motor Company, New York. Engineer Department.
this is a part uh, department. Uh, let me see. Hello, part. Oh, they got a lot of stops here. Nice. That's the Mac truck. That's logo for it. Oh, look at this. The display for gotta be 19. No, it's this truck 1930, right? This is a really old truck here. Oh, look at this 1925 Mac SE. This is uh, the AC was produced from 1960 1939. The British arm purchased several dozens of units in World War One, nicknamed the truck Bulldog. And I guess they changed it to Metro, I guess, because of their rock dependability in 1922. The Mac company adopted Bulldog as its company logo. The Bulldog first appeared as Hood or Normal in 1932, has been a part of Mac history ever since. This truck was traded in Tri State 1962, right here, 1962. At time, it was a street service working as a plow truck for logging company after many years. In Parade and Source Wars decided to permanently retire our name of the Bulldog and place on the display our new facility in Little Rock, Arkansas in uh, 2017. That's the brakes. And that uh, looks like a transmission. That's the transmission. And that's the engine. That's engine displays here. Uh, they got that's the engine oils uh, filter one, two, three, uh, four. What engine is it uh, sitting right here? Is it a brand new engine? For the Mac, right? Mac truck only. Yeah, it's a Mac engine. That's uh, 2020, 2021? Uh, like 2010. Yeah, you guys, nice display here. Feel like I'm in a museum here. Mac, Mac museum. <laughs> Now, do you have a patch for, I got a 2015 Volvo? I need a, uh, for the rock arm, uh, like uh, inside has a, what they call ball socket. You get the last 80 of bin? Yeah, uh, FM 190-673. Uh, if you have, give me a uh, three, please. Uh, they are 5 o'clock close. They're ready to go home soon. Uh, here you go. This is United States Pattern Office. Uh, they decided to have a logo and a bulldog. Uh, that's their logo. So when they have a logo like this, commercial, they have to be have a uh, Federal government, United States uh, Patent Office, they have to be, must be registered so no one can use their logos. So this is their pattern. Uh, they did it, uh, fire July 2nd, 1932. Uh, they had a first patterns right there, 1932.
A lot of folks not even born in 1932. Application filed July 2nd, 1932. Uh, they have a, a pattern serial number 44254. Term of a pattern, 14 years. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes. What is it that you're trying to get exactly? Uh, I did, uh, inside have a little tiny uh, ball socket. The six cylinder have a six, but I don't need, uh, uh, just need three in case. Uh, give me three, please. You know what, they have a, a Bulldog used as you guys Mack truck uh, logo. They had a pattern which they are 1932. Now that pattern lasts long 14 years. So you have to be re-register uh, again, pay, uh, you know, how they work, pattern. I have no idea, I've never patented yeah, That's a 14 years, you know, then, and you don't buy that again, people are gonna take that over. <laughs> yes. Which one is it that you, what is it that you're needing exactly in it? Uh, what's a ragam? That right there? Yep, that's the one. You just need that, all three of those? Yeah, all three, ragam, yep. Yeah. Is that the ragam? No, cylinder, go to cylinder please, cylinder ragam, injector. This is your rocker arm for your injectors. Now, when you look at that uh, injector, that's an intake. Middle have an injector. Last one has a uh, exhaust. On top of it have an uh, engine brake. Because this is the rocker arm right here. Right, right. So no, that one right there. I need, I need a ball, uh, ball socket. That's a uh, uh, each here. Each uh, injector right next to the ball socket, there's a one, two, three, uh, six of them. But I just need three. Now, hold on. That goes uh, right here. Injector. Uh, injector, injector. There's a ball socket. That's a big ball socket. Uh, that one's selling for like uh, $15, $13. Do you remember price? No, I haven't looked up the price on any of these yet. I haven't looked up anything other than what I'm showing you right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, give me a ball socket when you see it. Uh, three ball sockets. And the injector and the uh, arms. These are your rock arm. These are your rocker arms right here. These are the rocker arms. Mm -hmm. So when you break that down to the piece that you're wanting to get, the only thing that you can get on these is this without getting the whole rocker arm. These are the little jets, is mm. what they're calling them. Then you have the adjusting screw, and then you've got the hex nut that holds it in place. Yeah, they had a ball socket, that's what they call. Can you can you look at the ball socket, name of the ball socket? Are you talking about the cup that's inside of it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The sleeves. Slips, probably, yeah. Not, not slips. The little cups that the injectors are sitting in. Yeah, yeah. Uh, ball socket, little thing. They're going to inside. You gotta hook it in, push it in. That's the injector. Mm -hmm. And this is the cup and that it sits in. Push it in, push it in. Right next to, right here, ball socket going to there. Right next to the injector. One is going inside. No, that's the that's the bridge. They're going to either in here or in here. It looks like this. One. That's an exhaust rocker arm right there. Yeah, yeah, that that right here. That's the that one is going inside. So is this one right here what you need? Yeah, ball socket. Yep, that's that's going inside. Yeah, there you go, ball socket. Yep. 
Uh, I got a YouTube channel. It's a little bit of advertising. Uh, I took some picture outside in here. So I can print my YouTube. I got about 200, about 200, 300 customers, my fellow fans. Yeah, they got very nice items here. They selling for the driver seat. That's automatic. That comes with the remote control right here. Uh, looks like it has a massage. It has a massage. It looks like real comfort. Yep, that has a massage in there. Uh, very nice. That slippers. Uh, Oh no? Yeah, I went to several places. They have to be a special order for that. It looks like the, the only one that I can see that has any in stock is our drop from the dairy store. Yeah, yeah. They said that uh, when you the old problem, they have to buy whole in a rock arm. They said so. I ordered that and I got there already, but I want for in case extra. So that's okay if you don't have. Because the whole rock arm like uh, four hundred dollars, you know that comes with uh, you know everything: injector, exhaust joystick, intakes, and the uh, engine brakes. About four hundred dollars. I get that one. Here's the, here's the part number on it, so that way. Uh, that's all oh, I see. In case, all right, right. Appreciate. Uh, but as far as anything else, I don't know why. That's the ball socket, right? Uh, yeah. Ball socket. Yeah. That's the ball socket number. Yeah, that. I don't have any. I can order two of them in, but that's about as many as I can get. How long take to order order in usually? Uh, usually between like four to five days. Four to five days. You know what? You know Amazon.com. Amazon. Oh yeah. When they say that on TV, uh, YouTube, we deliver it next day. I have yet. To that's that's it. a kind of a bullshit. It's not. I've never once got Amazon to do me next day. Because I order uh, injector, injector right for Volvo truck. They're selling very cheap. You guys are selling for about 600 And Amazon, they're selling for 300 Guess what? It's not the price. Delivery time, 10 days. I need a truck today. <laughs> 10 days is no good. Yeah, there's a, the bigger states that have like Amazon fulfillment centers and everything. Uh-huh. They can do the same day shipping, like same day delivery. Boy, it's not same day anymore. It's not. When, no, it's not. Certain item, yes, they can deliver the same day, but like a commercial special parts like that, it took 10 days. Because they're ordering from uh, overstock warehouses like our PDCs and stuff at a much cheaper uh, price. I want to looking for like a special delivery option, like an express delivery, pay extra next day. They don't have that. They don't have that option. They would, though. Yeah, no, they don't have. So not every item. So I, I, I had a little disappointed because... Uh, you know, same day delivery, free delivery, uh, some of them is all nonsense. But uh, actually, we're closing down this side. Yeah, yeah, uh, I'm at the service. They do service. Okay. Fixing my truck. Okay, just uh, I'm going to open this back up. Okay. Hey, this is uh, Volvo Mac truck. Uh, folks, uh, have a wonderful day. And uh, they got a nice display here, old truck. So long. Bye.